Hi, I'm Alex. Hi, I'm Chris. And this is our new weekly video series, World of Labels. Yeah, each week we're going to take a look at some of the work we do here at Etiquette and showcase some of the fantastic products that feature our labels. That's right, and we're starting with Belton Farms Smoked Red Fox. So Belton Farms Smoked Red Fox, the new version in the uh, red in the Fox family of cheeses from Belton Farm, uh, one of the great British cheesemakers and winners of multiple international awards and I would say they are some of the best proven cheeses in the world. Um, we're very lucky to make a lot of labels for their range of products. Again, namely so the smoked red fox. That's right, they've also got white fox uh, available. They're absolutely delicious. Oh, red is my favorite. Uh, I think so, yeah. Yeah? Definitely red, yeah. Well, I mean, let's get into the label first before we have some of the cheese, because we're going to most definitely eat some of the cheese. Um, I really like the designs. I like the modern look of it. Um, they were designed by a company in Manchester called BGN, uh, who did a sort of rebrand for Belton a few years ago. And they've also done a, a, a TV ad campaign for this as well. So you might have already seen these. You might have already tried it. If you haven't, check the link in the description for the Belton shop and you can go and buy some. But uh, Alex, what do you think of this design? I like it, I especially like the, the use of golden ink. It uh, makes it very sort of um, distinguished and, and uh, premium looking. Yeah. Uh, I enjoy the, um, the usage of, of the uh, Belton Farm tree, which is an actual tree that, that is, you can find there on yeah. the farm, which makes it special and, and very sort of personal, organic. Yeah, I love um, that. Yeah, so absolutely amazing. And I do like the, uh, the, black, uh, the black packaging. I think it's It looks premium, special, doesn't it? It looks yes. cool. Yeah, I love the tree bit. That's my favorite bit because I've been to Belton a lot of times and I love going You've there. Seen because the it's, oh, I've seen the tree. I've seen the cows. It's, it's such a beautiful place to visit and to work, etc., etc. And um, yeah, I love going there. So. I like the fox as well because it gives an opportunity for some great animations that you might have seen as well. And yeah, it's yeah. just a good looking, good looking cheese. Yeah, the marketing campaigns that the guys have built and have done for this have been absolutely fantastic. They really have kind of pushed the boat out on it, and the TV ad was was really, really cool. So check it out if you haven't seen it. Love right. It. Should we eat some cheese? That's right. Bring it up. There it oh, is. There cheese, it is. Cheese, cheese. I'm right. just going to pop these out of the way. Okay. Ladies first, of course, as always. <laughs> right, let's have some. Hello. My That's word. Right. Mm. That crunch. My word. Oh right. my god. Yeah. It's calcium lactate crystals. Okay. That you can taste. And as you can see on the label, this cheese is um, it's smoked over oak, 10 year old oak chips, I think, uh, mm. to give it that really distinctive flavor. And it's really, really tasty. Now I'm no food reviewer by any means. I'm a good eater of food. I'm not a great reviewer of food, of course, but a bit more. this is absolutely delicious. Mm. It's so good. It's so good. What now, do you think? I think we've got something that's going to go great with the cheese. Okay. Okay. Right, what we've got is Macassero's oh, Marmalata, yeah. yes. which is a very <laughs> special um, Italian chili jam. Now, Nakasero are a company founded by a lady called Gita Raikumdalia, and it's a sort of a tribute to her Ugandan heritage and her memories of, of growing up in Uganda, and a kind of the recipes are based on artisan recipes from Uganda, I think from her grandmother. That's right, yeah. Yeah, so um, I love the design of the label. Oh, I yes. I think the label is so cool. Um, fantastically modern looking label, again, similar to the Red Fox. Uh, yes, I, I think I especially enjoy the fonts. I think mm. that the fonts look absolutely great. And as far for the um, label design itself, we've managed to um, put some different kinds of varnishes to uh, to give it some texture and, and some special uh, look. Yeah, yeah, it's a very it's a touchy feely label, isn't it? So it's as very... I as I rub on there, we've got a rough touch varnish mixed with a sort of high gloss varnish that really kind of gives it a good. Very on shelf looking, appeal, yeah. Yes, and as right. you look at it on shelf, you see it and you think, I like the colours, they stand out, there's a really nice contrast. The design is really cool. Like Alex said, the fonts are really modern and cool. And also you've got the Ugandan national bird there, the silver crested crane. Silver crested crane, crane I think. Silver it is. crested yes, which crane. Which is another 
uh, you know, heritage uh, part of it, I suppose. Yeah, it's a hark back to kind of uh, uh, Gita's heritage and uh, and what they're right. sort of trying to get across so, with so the So we have the eaten now? Yeah, let's eat yeah. it, yeah, yeah. Stop me talking, fill my mouth with food. <laughs> right, let's sip some of that. So, oh, the smell. Uh, it's so good. It's so mm. good. Right, not too much, I guess. What? I don't even swear. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there you go. That's oh, for you. Thank you very much. It smells so good. Mm, I dropped it. Um, oh, do you want another one? I'm good for yeah. now. <laughs> Feel that. Oh, yes. If you'd like to find out more about these products, please take a look in the descriptions below. You'll find links to the Belton Farm website and to the Nakasero website, where you can look at their shops and purchase a ton of their amazing products. I think we should add that oh. these are um, Vegetarian Society approved and vegan. Of course, yes. Uh, so, you know, uh, oh, and that brings me to uh, our next week's uh, Plant & Co vegan yogurts that we're going to be talking about. Wow, so I'm going to get to eat some delicious right. yogurt next week That's as well. Right. What more could I ask for? <laughs> we hope you enjoyed this episode. We hope you like the labels that we do and you will definitely Love the products. So uh, we'll see you next week. Yeah, see you next week.